Hello everyone, Suntana Guy here, bringing you back another episode of The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask for Nintendo 64. In the last episode, we collected the rest of the stray fairies and beat the boss of Great Bay Temple and freed the innocent spirit from Georg. And that's kind of all we did in the last episode. And in today's episode, let's first go see how Lulu and all the Zoras are doing. Are they any better? Is Lulu now feeling like herself? Is the frame rate ever going to stop dri dripping like crazy? Yeah, I seem to pinpoint all these dang frame rate issues. <laughs> anyway, let's see how Lulu's doing. Hey, cow! You came back safely. That's good. I was surprised when my voice turned that lonely island into a turtle. But that song you play for me, my mother used to sing it often, long ago. Those eggs were laid to remind me of that. That song was from when I was a very young child, so I have forgotten it. I have put you through the su- let me try again. <clears throat> I put you through some horrible experiences, Macau. But I'm all better now. Well, the town's concert is very soon. Let's start our rehearsal. up a little cut right there um yep everyone is now better everything's now for now back to normal until we turn back time into where we're gonna have to recover her voice again but there's really now no reason for us to go back to that temple anyway okay next up i want to do before visiting the fairy's fountain i want to go back to ikana canyon there is now one more grave that we got to visit and it contains a good item too Poof. Man, I mean I had that extraordinary memorable thief or how the heck it that sounds but I still like saying it let's see because we're in the south side north south Okay, we need to go to the east side, so... Sure, I want to go that way. I want to go back to the beach. Oh, well, we can just take a shortcut. Camera! Don't you do this to me now, camera! Okay, yep, that's where we want to go. What do you say? Since we're Zora. The Kenyon at Stone Tower lasts its way. It's dangerous at night, so be extreme, especially exquisitely careful. Huh. I thought he was going to do something because we're Zora, because as a Deku, he's a racist. As a Goron, we're awesome. As Kid Link, or Young Link, we're respected because we have a sword. Zora people, nah, they're just normal. <laughs> okay, let's revert back to normal Link. Ah, uh, Pona Song. Eh, yeah, horsey, horsey, horsey. You know, there's something I really gotta say um, about Pona in this game. I think Epona 
is so barely need to be used in this game. Like, the only time you need... What happened? Like, the only time you need a Pona is just for getting over obstacles. Like, that's the only time you ever need her. Any other time when you're out in the Eterna field, like, just just use Goron Link, because he's the fastest. I mean, yeah, there's the Bunny Hood, but... Goron Link is the faster one to get around. Speaking of masks... So let's equip the Captain's Mask. Because we're Captain Link. Ah, dang it. Ah, I got Jinx. So what does Jinx do? Well... When you're jinxed, I can't draw my sword, but I can still use my items. So, how do you cure jinx? Well, get your ocarina out. That's not creepy whatsoever. Play the Song of Storms. And voila. Huh? Ah, Captain, sir! Excuse me, sir! Everyone, give the Captain your attention! We haven't seen you in time! We haven't seen you in some time, Captain, sir! As per your order, sir, we have been guarding these graves closely. We have all been expecting your next order, sir! What shall we do? I love how the option to continue to guard the grave is still there. Open it! Yes, sir! Everyone, follow me! It still fascinates me how... Bones can break stone. Hey, this looks a little familiar. Okay, next up you want to get your... Lens of Truth out. Because there's more to this area than meets the eye. I also recommend you either have your hookshot or I killed something. Or your bow and arrow. Also, finally, there are returning enemy keys. So it looks like keys are still in this game. They're just in different areas. Even though the bad bats are the more well-known names. I mean, well, keys are well more known than the word bad bats. Oh my gosh, it's a giant skeleton! I have no idea why I took, why I unequipped my Winter Truth. Oh dear. And I still made through. That's how awesome I am. Got some pots. And they have nothing for me. Oh boy! A wall that's blocking my way. What should I ever do? Hey, it saves me up on items. I should probably now de-equip the Winter Truth. Oh, goody, you're here. I have another iron knuckle. Navi! No, not wait, what? Not Navi! Rule number one, Tal, always keep your enemy targeted. 
the whiteness. Ooh, four heart damage. Oh, this is not going well. Never mind, it went fine. Oh boy, what do we get? What's it gonna be? What's it gonna be? Is it Godzilla? Is it Gamera? It's a piece of heart. Oh yeah, by the way, I'm gonna miss this right now. Um, I believe I said this in the, um, oh, what episode? It was the second um, Golden Scotia thing. I don't know why I bother to say the 29th heart piece at all. At that point, it was too late for me to remind future me to know, oh, hey, this is the first heart piece, this is the second heart piece, this is the third heart piece, this is the fourth heart piece, etc., etc. That So I think that's something I'm going to start doing from now on. Every time I do a Zelda Let's Play, it's always mention each number. Oh, boy, these little enemies are back. And the frame rate still goes crazy. In general, the frame rate never actually bothers me, but... At least, at least to memorable moments. Well, to me, they're memorable. I love it when the frame rate gets all... Slow down for whatever reason. Whether there's too much on the screen, whether we kill something. Kind of like that. Anyway, I think that... I could be wrong, but I think that's all we can now do in the graveyard for now. Next up, you want to get out your Gero's mask. Gero, Gero, Gero. I'm going the wrong way. Oh! He's back. Oh, yeah, 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 that's right, I turned back time because of that little incident in the Great Bay Temple when the N64 reset itself. Oh, well, nothing I could do about it. Anyway, remember this guy? <laughs> That's a nice mask you're wearing. That is the mask of the leader of the ninjas who once spied on the hilltop castle with the bloodstained history. With that, you may be able to call out their spirits that even now are still wandering. Perhaps you may be able to save the souls that wander beyond here. <laughs> And then after that, he randomly disappears. By the way, it is required to have the hook shot. It is required to have the hook shot or. Dang, I'm on top of things now. It is required to have the hook shot. Don't have the hook shot, you can't get into this canyon. By the way, keep your Garrow's mask on. There's something important up ahead. Wow, that guy was dedicated to chasing me. Gip those. Yay. As before I do that, let me get, do get this activated. Okay, I was about to say, what the heck happened? Master, you call. Mm. Who are you? Jump. I chopped off his foot. Re regrettable. Although my rival, you are spectacular. I shall take my bow by opening my heart and revealing my wisdom. The souls of the compost name felt rest in the kind of graveyard 
I have heard this brother, Sha, is more than a cop. That Sha is here in Kana. Belief or disbelief rest with you. The old fashioned believe it or not. To die without leaving a corpse, that is the way of us God. And so he blows himself up. By the way, it is also required to have the ice arrows with you. You don't have the ice arrow. Oh, that's a close call. You don't have the ice arrows. You cannot proceed through e com How long they can remain frozen, but oh well. But yes, you are required to have the ice arrows and the hook shot. You don't have either of those items, you cannot enter the rest of Ikana Canyon. Oh, look at this tingle. And I probably didn't have just the right amount of money, too. And not only is Tingle here, I mean, yeah, oh, try again. Not only is Tingle here, there's also an owl statue. So now we can come into to this area without needing to travel. Man, there's a lot of Giptos around here. Okay, Tingle. Make sure you never have children. I'm gonna freeze your balls. <laughs> nope, that didn't work. Oh well. What's this? Green clothes? My fairy? Sir, so, could you be my champion of forest fairy? Oh my. <laughs> my name is Tingle. I think I am the same as you, sir. A forest fairy. Alas, though I'm already age 25, no fairy has come to me yet. My father tells me to grow up and act my age, but why? I tell you, Tino is the very reincarnation of a fairy. Now, while I stand here waiting for a fairy of my own, I sell maps to help my father. Lucky, lucky, you're so lucky to have a fairy. I know, I know, we should be friends. Yes, yes, in exchange... <coughs> I just now realize I still have the mask on. I will sell you a map for cheap as a sign of my friendship. Will you buy one of Dingle's maps? So, he gives us Stone Tower and Clock Town. Either, but well, one of them is useful, but why does he sell us Clock Town map when we already have it? Yippee! You got a map of the Stone Tower. Now you can find your way around the canyon. The red arrow on the map shows where you... Where you Entered and the yellow arrow shows your current location. <laughs> well, call again. <laughs> tingle, tingle, call it. Bah! <laughs> These are the magic words that Tingle created himself. Don't steal them. I just did. Okay. Next up. Okay. Next up. We're gonna go back. To Zora's cap. We're not going in there, but we need to go back there. Heck, I just basically came all this way to get the statue and to get Tingle. There he goes, dancing his butt off. Okay, or the hook shot. All I need is the Zora mask. Okay, now I'm gonna show you where to get the next stray fairies. Whee! Okay, I thought I could actually uh, do that, but guess not. Ow! 
little jerk. Okay, revert back to normal. Now we're gonna do some platform jumping! Link showing off some new moves at the same time. Okay, technically they're not really new. They're this is the actually the only Zelda game, to my knowledge, where Link does all those flips and stuff. There's no other Zelda game where he does that. You son of a bitch. There's no other Zelda game that does that. Like most of them are just the normal. Oh, I gotta jump. Careful. If I fall back in the water, I get to go all the way back. Oh, silly me. Simple as that. Blowing your face off, it helps with everything. Looks like I'll be talking to Stray Fairy with the mask on. <laughs> oh, this one has purple hair, but she still has those big pointy bong bongs. Oh, congratulations, young one. I am the Great Fairy of Courage. Thank you for returning my broken and shattered body to normal. As thanks, I shall lend you my strength. Excuse me. I now flex my chest with the blast mask. Your defense has been strengthened, Emmys now do half as much damage as before. Come see me whenever you are o overcome by weariness. So, what do we get for doing all that? Well, like she said, we got an increase in defense. That means we'll take not as much damage as we would normally. Okay, one last stop before we end off today's video. And that's not to pop my leg. So, I think it's now time for a little choir music. Because now all the frogs are here. Well, if it isn't the great Danchero, shall we sing once again? Sure, but I'm going to turn on my music real quick. My volume. Boys volume real quick. The conducting was spectacular, and all our members rose to the occasion. This is how deeply we were moved by your spectacular conducting. And for that, we got another heart piece. Wow, two heart pieces in one video. How generous. Let us do it again sometimes. Okay, that's all we're going to do for today's video. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. We'll be exploring probably more on a canyon now that we have access 
to the area. If you enjoyed today's episode, please share, like, subscribe if you want to. And I'll see you all for the next episode. Have a nice day.